What's going on with all my money motivated styles, man? This is gonna be a quick little video. I wasn't even supposed to make a video that yet. Y'all see, I dropped a song like an hour ago, two hours ago. Well, when I was walking to the park, I had seen my homeboy I grew up with, you know what I mean? And this would inspire me to make this video because I really forgot to tell him I'm proud of him, you know what I mean? He watched my channel from time to time, you know what I mean? Like every video, but we just chopped it up. We just some people in the hood. And you know we all came from the same place, man. It's just some people you just you just be so happy to see them doing good, you know what I mean? Just them having a car, a nice car did just energy just up, you know what I mean? Cause it's, man, it's been so much stuff that went on in this hood, you know what I mean? I, I don't when I speak about the hood, I don't say it like I'm the only one from the hood, you know what I mean? Cause I know from, some people probably take offense to that they're like, well, you ain't the only from. I know that, you know what I mean? So that's why I want to share this experience with you, you know what I mean? If you know you from the hood or you from a, a place of low income, you know what I mean? If you done made it somewhere, you still, you staying afloat or you got the mindset that you have now, it's, it's time to be proud of it, you know what I mean? A lot of people got to be happy for other people too because I'm happy for him just like I'm happy for myself, you know what I mean? It don't matter if that person has more than you or you have more it really don't matter just to see that person still being alive in the right mindset you know what i mean because a lot of people who just not here today you know what i mean who i grew up with i didn't see young people younger than me who i didn't watch grow up get killed you know what i mean and it was a homeboy like two uh two months ago i watched i watched them grow up basically you know what i mean he had been in jail so long but as soon as he got out of jail I end up seeing him when he got out of jail, like two weeks before he got killed. He got killed, he ended up getting killed, you know what I mean? But when I seen him, I rolled past him. Some told me that I wanted to stop, but I just knew what type of stuff he was into still, you know what I mean? I just, you know what I'm saying? A lot of people who probably watch this or whatever, or watch, who know me or whatever, they probably can look at it like it's some uh, scary shit or whatever, but I know I got a purpose on this planet to fulfill, you know what I mean? I can't be putting my life in jeopardy just to go say hi to an old friend or a friend that I know indulged in a certain type of activity, you know what I mean? And then when I didn't go see him, then I found out he got killed two weeks later, even though he had survived two weeks after I seen him, it still could have been like, damn, I could have been around him and shit could have happened. You know what I'm saying? Shit could have popped out. That's why I followed my good instinct now. I used to ignore it sometimes, but now, I really don't ignore it no more, you know what I mean? Because you just got, it's just sense, man. You know, when you know some people didn't, you know what I'm saying, dipping and dabbing and some wrongdoing or whatever, you know what I mean? It's still RIP him, you know what I mean? Because we still, you just gotta understand, man. Some people are still in this matrix and they don't know why they really killing each other. They don't know the depth of why they doing what they doing. You know, we doing stuff because we want to make money and we just want to live a better life, but we don't know how this thing is really set up. That's what my channel is about. We know what it's set up. You know, we, I mean, we know how it's set up on this channel. You know what I mean? But people in this outside world, we got to treat them kind of differently because they know they still part of this program. They, they still will kill you for materialistic things. You know what I mean? They materialistic people. You know what I mean? So we just got to, you got to just stay straight. You know what I mean? It might be a home girl that you want to see. If you know she out here doing shit that, she, that you don't do, just stay away from her, you know what I mean? Like everybody, you ain't gotta speak to every time you see them. If you feel like you, you know what I'm saying, grew up with this person, just have their phone number, hit them, you know what I mean? Shit, because you you in a, another area, you calling them ain't gonna do no damage, you know what I'm saying? But you being around that person, you know, they probably just robbed this person, they got somebody looking for them, they got money, this person got money on their head. It's shit like they be going on in the hood and most people won't even tell you when they got money on their head or something. Like, I didn't experience a lot of shit. You know what I'm saying? There's people out here who doing a lot of shit that can put your life in harm's way. You know what I'm saying? This really for the, the youth, you know? For the people who out here want to think it's cool to hang around these people who really about their life. You know what I mean? It's okay if you probably hang around the dudes who ain't really doing shit. They just want to name or whatever. But it's people out here who really doing the shit that they saying in these rappers. It's people out here really doing the shit that these rappers talking about. So... For you to hang around them and you know you're not doing none of that shit, you know what I mean? Stop trying to be cool because you could lose your life. It's a lot of people's baby mama in the past and got killed 
a lot of, you know what I mean? A lot of women like these type of dudes, but they, you could possibly end up losing your life. It's plenty of people, you know what I'm saying? Just in Memphis that I didn't, I didn't heard of, and, and some of them I know, they girl and lost their life just, just by being with them. You know what I mean? They siblings and lost their life just by being a part of a family. You know what I mean? So, man, some people, sometimes you can't escape it because if you living with this person and you underage and you can't really move out, then I feel you. You know what I mean? I feel you. On air level, I feel you. I know how this stuff goes on. But if you can potentially get away from a lot of stuff, stay away from it. You know what I mean? Just stay away from it. If you want to just, if you feel like you got a deeper meaning and deeper, deeper purpose in life and that you have yet to fulfill, you know what I mean? Go handle that, you know? Go, you know what I'm saying? Get on your being and get on your shit. Go do what you got to do and stop trying to be around something for a certain image, you know what I mean? Or if you're not around for an image, really your family member that you really love, still, man, still got to have sense, man. Because a lot of people, sometimes they doing the evil, but the people who doing the good are catch them bullets. And it's just real shit. For real, this is just coming from experience, man. All this stuff I talk about on my channel is from experience. So... That's why I'd be so happy to see the guys who never was really on it, you know what I'm saying, but would get on it, because everybody in the hood, even the ones you see that's not on it, everybody would get on it, you know what I'm saying, just to, because you're a man or if you're a woman, just to defend yourself, because you have to defend yourself. You can't just be out here letting anybody do anything to you. But I'm saying, it's just the ones you see who you know had their mindset that you kind of sure, you know what I mean? It's good to see them being where you thought they would be or going towards that road that you knew they were going to go down. You know what I mean? So, I just wanted to, man, shout out to my homeboy, man. Uh, shout out to Jeremy. You know what I mean? I fuck with, you know what I'm saying, what he got going on and he just always been positive. You know what I mean? It's like it's like a, a select few of us uh, select few of us who always been like kind of positive in the hood. Not always positive, because we're going to say if you have trials and tribulations growing up, you know what I'm saying, in places like this, but I'm saying for the most part, not really crashing out. That's what I'm trying to say. You know what I mean? It's a lot of us, we, we've we crashed out, and a lot of us haven't crashed out. You know what I mean? And it, you know what I'm saying, not throw no shots at nobody. It's just people handle this, different situations differently. You know what I mean? Some people just put themselves in situations where they have to crash out, basically. You know what I mean? I know that might sound crazy, like, oh, this person ain't got to crash out. But some people, you can't play with some people, man. You know what I mean? Some people, you got just got to go on and show them. You know what I mean? So that's why I just stay, keep my distance from people that I feel like I got to show something to. Because if you don't show them, they going to end up trying to show you some shit. You know what I mean? So just stay away from it. Stay, from, stay away from the negativity. There's so many positive people in this world. Go chill with a female, bro. You know what I'm saying? If you're a female, go chill with a dude who don't, like who got something going. You know, he ain't gotta be rich. Make sure he got a drive and a vision, you know what I mean? Help him with their vision, vice versa. Stop trying to be against each other. Stop being jealous in these relationships, man. A lot of people can be a lot further in their life and relationships if they would just stop hating on their partner or just help their partner build. You know what I mean? Just that's all I really got to say about that, you know what I mean? That's all I had to say, you know what I'm saying? But man. Shout out to everybody who's giving everybody they props, you know what I'm saying? Everybody who's giving people they flowers while they still here, you know what I mean? A lot of people going to wait till you dead and gone to say, oh, this person was this. This person was very influential in my life. This person helped me do this. They're going to wait till somebody to die. They don't have enough dignity and they don't have their pride getting the way, their ego getting the way, so where they can't say somebody has helped them along their journey. There's a lot of people watch my channel who probably will never give me my props, you know what I'm saying? Say, you help me through this, you help me with this, you know what I mean? A lot of y'all do, though. So I just appreciate all the ones who come and say, yeah, bro, you didn't help me. I like this song. Your, your music is highly motivational. Your your words are highly motivational, you know what I'm saying, when it comes towards my life. And I appreciate y'all right back, you know what I'm saying? But I ain't going to make this too long, man. Y'all be listening, walking in this smoke.